Hey guys, Devin here. Now we're going to be doing some testing on this site over here. Actually, just gonna hit a better, just a little bit of a better spot. Um, here we are on my Samsung S20. You can see here, band 66 at 10 megahertz with NR support. Um, this SIM card just does not support 5G. It's a tablet SIM card, so I'm just gonna move my vehicles where we get like 30 SNR, and then we'll do some tests. All right, found a better spot. Let's see that there. There's the site. Might let me zoom on it. It's right behind that pole. That new the new white panel at the very top, you can tell the color difference is new. This site is being upgraded. Rogers is doing a ton of upgrades around here. So I'm gonna show you guys. This is the bands that were deployed before. Just on a new equipment here. And then they also added 600 megahertz. It doesn't combine in this combo here. But, you can see, it's 100 meg down. They're definitely gonna have to add capacity here because this is, serves the university as well and some businesses and a lot of uh, residential neighborhoods as well. So we're getting quite good speeds. It's definitely what we should be getting for what we're on. Now, I'm gonna show you guys Seventy one here. I'm also going to open up this app here. So you can see here, B71. Okay. It's a 10 megahertz channel, but it's 600 megahertz. So, as you can tell here, if we go and go like this, pull up service menu, there you go. Not the greatest signals because of where I'm sitting, I guess. And I'm probably because I'm another, beside another tower, beside the bell tower right now. So it did uh, drop out on me. I'll kind of give this a better position here. There you guys go. Quite, quite quick. This is what we want. We need this. And apparently this has this pairs with 5G. So I'm guessing it does it's N66 and or sorry, LTE 66 and then uh, 71. But if I see that look at that, 30 upload. Let's see if I can somehow make these two combine. I don't think it's gonna happen. I think this phone either doesn't support it on LTE. Yeah, so there's 66 only. Yeah, see that's that's really quick for one band. Like that's a lot quicker than you're seeing there on the uh, N70 or LT71 band 71. So it obviously doesn't combine LTE. You can see not supported here. I may also have it. Yeah, I have, I have a disabled 5G, so we'll just go all and all. The SIM card doesn't support 5G. Unfortunately, I'm going to try and get a SIM card that does support 5G. So there we go again, probably the same bands. Yeah, 12 and band 66, which is just, it's not actual band 66, it is MFBI band 4 but still really good speeds I'm really impressed happy to see that Rogers is finally doing some work here and not letting the network rot because there's a lot of towers that are just this is what they're equipped with and then Bell is literally 500 megabits per second on every single site they have four-way carrier aggregation plus an NR carrier so Rogers needs to step it up. They do have a lot of tight sites that are four-way carrier, carrier aggregation, but they need to get all, all the sites done. It's about time they touch this site. They haven't touched it in years, in years. Like, I literally think longer than I've been alive. 
So it's good to see that they're doing some work. Hope you guys are enjoying the videos. Stay tuned for more.